What are those? Welcome back to the channel. Today we got the Camaro up on the lift and we are going to be doing the DSX auxiliary fuel system. So I got it laid out here, making sure I got all the parts and uh, watched a couple videos online and they also have instructions here. And we're just see if we can do this uh, easy as possible. This is my first time videoing and installing something, so Bear with me. All right, so I just went over the instructions and everything to see if I even know what I'm doing, and it looks pretty straightforward. I'm just gonna take my time because you do have to tap into the, um, the gas tank, uh, which you gotta tap into it about, about right there. Um, and then you run your lines probably under here. You gotta take this off. Video I watched you can actually go up through that hole but you can see daylight, and uh, that's where you're gonna be wiring it up and get it, get it fitted in. So, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna start and then give you guys updates along the way, and um, yeah, we'll see if we can do it. All right, so I'll show you where what I've done so far, which isn't much, but uh, we just mocked it up. So we got the line from DSX that goes all the way through. It goes through here up and then I mounted the fuel pump right here with the bracket just loosely fit the line that comes back over into the fuel line we're going to be taking this fuel line after we tap the gas tank and I have that line running back and it's going to go into the fuel tank this one goes there so I mean pretty simple install uh, just following the directions, trying to at least. So the scary part comes now that we're gonna be tapping the gas tank and hopefully we don't screw that up because that would really suck. Sure. Thanks, Hannah. This is my brother, Nick. The guy I was telling you about, fiance Hannah. They are currently painting the garage because they are getting married soon. But we're just gonna be draining the gas now. And once that's drained, then we're gonna put in the fitting and then get it all tidied up. All right, so I just got it drilled. My brother drilled it out for me, uh, just so I wouldn't screw it up. So uh, here it is. It's simple, but scary. So it comes with this green stuff. It's almost like liquid plumber's tape. And then you just goop it all up. And then thread her in and it's supposed to keep dry and you don't want to over tighten it because if you over tighten it then you'll strip it out because it's obviously just plastic so just snug and what's making the seal is actually this stuff all right so I uh, just got it all tidied up uh, starts back here at the pump got the line running through there and it goes all the way to the pump. Pump mounted there. And then the line that goes back. And then it ties into this T. So, next thing I need to do is tie in the electric. So that's the next step. Okay, pull down. Oh, yes. Got it all done. 
except I didn't obviously do the complete wiring up to the ground and everything and hook it up to the um, the map sensor just because I have no motor so there's no point. <laughs> but uh, yeah let's give you a little rundown it looks really good so there's the start of it running through there and now it kind of disappears but it runs along here underneath this carpet so you can't even really see it. the only spots you see it are there there running along through there and then the pump sits the pump sits about about right here and then you got the line this is the uh, wiring and then I got it shoved up through that hole and it comes out where the brake booster is so one thing I wanted to show you which was kind of neat and I didn't know it had it DSX tuning and this is something I didn't know it had is a little indicator so it tells me when it's on or off so I guess that's gonna wrap it up thanks for watching we'll see you later bye see the goats yeah boys I'm you Hey bud. Hey buddy. Hey cow. What are you doing, bud? No, I don't got any food. Little asshole. Were you sleeping? Hmm? Were you sleeping? <laughs>